Hey bakers, this is Margaret with Desserts and Delicious. Let's make a four inch, five layer Oreo cake. Uh, this is gonna be in a two part series. So here are my ingredients and to my bowl, I'm gonna add my um, cake mix. I'm gonna add one egg at a time. And the last two eggs, I'm just gonna add the egg whites, not the egg yolks, just the whites, okay? I'm gonna add a, a teaspoon of vanilla, a half a cup of flour, as well as a half a cup of sugar. I'm gonna add a cup of water, a half a pack of the Oreo Jello, a tablespoon of sour cream, okay? And this is what it's gonna be looking like in the bowl and then my stick of butter at the end there. So I attach my uh, paddle attachment and I mix. Now after it has mixed, I'm gonna add in some additional uh, crushed Oreos and I'm just gonna fold them in. Now here are my four inch tins. I've already sprayed them and I'm using this um, four inch round um, parchment paper and you can find these in my Amazon store. They have absolutely, absolutely come in handy. And I've cut out some strips of parchment paper that I'm going to um, put inside each of the cake pans. And I like this because it's gonna allow me to add, a, add more of my cake mix to the pan. And this helps me when I am trying to uh, decorate because I have more cake to work with. So, and here I'm measuring out all of my pans and I'm putting about 10 and 3 eighths ounces. Uh, once I filled all my pans, I wrapped them. I've added on my Wilton baking strip and here they are out the oven, nice and golden. Um, after they have cooled, I've moved them to a wire rack. And um, now I've removed the parchment paper so you can see it has a very light crumb on them. Stay for part two for the decorating. 